Rain in Leicester meant that only 43.4 overs were possible on the opening day of the match with Gloucestershire at Grace Road. The first session was limited to 11 overs after the morning was lost to the weather. Leicestershire starting well enough though through Angus Robson and Ned Eckersley after the home team had been inserted by Will Taveray on another very green looking pitch at Grace Road. Not that the ball seemed around too much, the two Leicestershire openers scoring 43 runs before tea, which was taken early because of yet more wet weather. They were finally back on at quarter to four and the batsmen took their opening partnership to 59, Eckersley with 23 of those. But on that score he turned a short ball from Liam Norwell into the hands of Kieran Nima Barnett at square leg. Robson continued to press on, now in partnership with Dan Redfern, who was making a rare appearance in the first team this summer. Batting was never that easy, but these two played well to ensure that the decision by the visitors to bowl first didn't fully pay off. Robson was at a 50 for the seventh time in this championship campaign when he hit David Payne for his sixth boundary of his 119th delivery. It had been a watchful and very valuable knock for his team. He and Redfern saw out 20 overs together in adding 59 runs for the second wicket, the same partnership as for the first one. Robson getting to 61 in the process before he was out, shortly before bad light took the players off for the final time in a day in which 52 overs were lost. Norwell was the man who dismissed Robson, a thin edge being taken behind by Gareth Roderick. But Redfern and the night watchman Rob Sayer survived the final couple of overs before the light became too bad to continue. It meant that Leicestershire ended the day on 127 for two. Redfern set to go again on the second morning with 29 runs to his name.